Some people have noticed that sometimes in the Mission Planner's quick screen, uh, there's some very large numbers uh, displayed. So for example, here we're seeing a distance to waypoint, which is 65,000, and a distance to home, which is about 13 million. Uh, so I just want to explain what's going on here. Uh, first of all, the distance to waypoint, um, when you have no uh, waypoint set, when there is no waypoint yet, uh, the distance to waypoint is defaulting to negative one. And unfortunately, we have a little display issue where that is, um, you know, we're displaying a negative number using an unsigned integer, so it becomes 65,000. You'll see that this becomes a reasonable number as soon as you enter loiter or start a mission. So I'm going to enter loiter now. Bang, goes to zero. Um, next one is the distance to home. So the underlying uh, thing to understand here is that there's actually two home positions. There's a home position which RG Copter stores uh, whenever it gets its first GPS lock or when you arm the motors. That's, that's the RG Copter's home. The other home is the mission planner's home. So uh, the mission planner also records a, a home location and actually this distance to home and distance to MAV are calculated from the mission planner's home to the to the location that the RG Copter is reporting to the mission planner. So uh, the way to fix this is to reset the home position of the mission planner. Easy way to do that is to go over to the flight planner screen and if I have a look here it looks like my home position is currently set to somewhere in South Africa. So that's a very long way. Uh, I could drag it, bring it over here, drop it on myself. Uh, you know, that, that's one way to fix it. The other one is to uh, click this home location and it will set it to my current, the RG Copter's current location. That's what I've just done. Now if I go back to the flight data screen, ta-da, down to two meters. All is good.